this morning actually this morning I was gonna eat a donut because I was like nobody's awake nobody's watching me I can literally eat this donut <laughs> Good morning, queens. It is currently day two of the sugar detox, darling. Yesterday was hard, I'm not gonna lie. It was a challenge, and then when I came home, I had steak, as I showed you guys. But then I saw in the corner of my damn eye this 13 box of donuts, um, like a box of 13 donuts. Um, and I was like, Katrina, what the hell? Why did you buy these? Like, And she said it was her husband's doing. But like, it took all of me to not open that box and eat about two damn donuts because bitch they look so good they're glazed donuts and i was like girl but i didn't i had a cucumber instead and i was like i will fantasize that this is a nice glazed donut but it's more healthy but right now i'm on my way to go get an ultrasound of my stomach to see what's going on in the tum tum did i say slaying the game once again in this video i don't think i did this morning but anyway, queens, welcome to another week with more slaying the game once again, bitch. You already know. A little late. But I just got done with my ultrasound, and bitch, if I wasn't already bloated, this bitch done put so much pressure onto my stomach. Literally, like, someone sat on my stomach for a good 35 minutes. So now I'm going to the dentist because I grind my teeth at night, so they gave me a mouth guard last time. So now I'm just here trying to get it and see if it's ready. Literally, Queens, they had it ready and they gave me like a fucking 3D model of my damn teeth in case I need to like get another mouth guard. They can just use that model. But that is so weird. I'm currently laying in bed as you guys can tell. I'm tempted just to sleep this day away because these are probably my most bingiest days of like just snacks and stuff. Is when I'm home all day. Like I have nothing to do today, it's my day off. I do have one, even though it feels like I work all the damn time. But tomorrow is going to be harder and harder, bitch, because tomorrow is the baby shower for my brother's girlfriend, and they're gonna have cupcakes and just pasta salad and everything I love. And bitch, I'm not gonna have anything. All I'm gonna have is this lettuce fucking wrap with dry Angus beef, bitch. Oh. So it's a bit later on in the day. I um, have been downstairs helping out the preparations for tomorrow's baby shower for my brother. So I just came upstairs because I am starving and literally all they're having downstairs is literally everything that I've been wanting. They have egg rolls, well spring rolls, and then they're having roast and it's just like, oh. yeah, I just had to come upstairs and cook something for myself before I literally drive myself insane because I am so hungry. I'm trying not to think about it because if I think about the hunger, I'm gonna want stuff that I don't need. But the headache is, is not as bad as yesterday, and it's kind of like faint. It definitely was hurting yesterday. Today it's just like, kind of like a tap on the head. Other than that, today is actually pretty damn successful. I am so super, still so pumped about this. But honestly, I do have to give props to um, you guys, you guys that are watching here right now, because honestly, you guys have been giving me the extra push that I have um, been needing these couple of days. Well, this morning, actually. This morning, I was gonna eat a donut because I was like, nobody's awake, nobody's watching me. I can literally eat this donut. It would just be my little secret. But then I was thinking, how could it be authentic for you guys um, if I'm eating donuts behind you guys' back, behind Katrina's back, behind um, my manager's back. So if I ate that donut, it wouldn't be the only thing that I ate today in secret. I'd be coming upstairs multiple times. I'd be hiding in my room, trying to eat as much junk as I could um, before the day's end. So I didn't, I bit my tongue. I was like, bitch, you can't do this to yourself.
it's a lot later now than last time I saw you, but I mean, I'm in the same place, same shirt, but um, nothing's really changed. I still have some urges, but I mean, this part of the day, I was not as strong as it was earlier. This day and a half literally showed me what I could be doing in my everyday life. Like, I don't need the sweets to consume me, so. I'm just super pumped. Like, I'm super excited that I'm doing this. Even though people are questioning why I'm doing this, it's just like, it's it's for me because I want to live a better, healthier life and not have to worry about different things creeping up on me because I'm eating unhealthy. So this is for strictly me and myself and I, bitch, if you don't approve, if you don't like what I'm doing, then don't fucking watch me. Don't fucking, you know, don't come to me. Okay, bitch? Because I'm not gonna be here for you. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm gonna go in and cook some dinner. But before I go, I do have to say, today's urges this morning were a lot worse than yesterday's urges. I think yesterday I had tweeted, I tweeted out saying that yesterday I was basically running on the adrenaline of the whole thing. Like I was strictly adrenaline and plus I had things to do. Today I had nothing to do. I mean, I do still have some adrenaline, but it's not like the first day. Um, adrenaline that you do get from anything you do. I definitely pushed through it. I didn't think I was gonna do it. I think I, I thought for a while I was gonna cave and have a donut. I was downstairs um, doing cupcakes for tomorrow's baby shower and I really thought that I was gonna cave and have a cupcake or lick some icing, And but I didn't. I kept strong. Some people wouldn't put themselves in a predicament where they are around sugar, but like honestly, it helps me more to actually sit there and face it than actually hide from it because if I hide from it, all I'm thinking about is it. If I'm around it, I am like, okay, Okay, I can do this, I can do this, I can do this. Queens, the day is over. So I'm just eating my dinner right here. I have some spinach, onions, and mushroom mix. I have chicken with slap your mama seasoning on it and some cucumbers on the side. That is what I'm eating for dinner. And then I'm going to bed and starting day three and the last day of the extreme detox. But after the extreme detox, it is not over. It's far from over because we have still 21 days of the sugar detox. So we can have some sugars and I'll explain this more to, in tomorrow's video, but we can have some healthy sugars, um, but we can't have a lot. And like I said, I'll explain more in tomorrow's video. So if you guys like the second day of the detox video, give it a thumbs up. Put it in the comments below, hashtag team no sugar if you're following along. And until tomorrow, queens, I'll go out there and slay that bitch.